Got to get the gains in, boy. Just gonna add a little bit. Don't add too much, cause then it's super salty. This is garlic salt. I added my, this is my choice right here, crushed red peppers. You guys don't have to add that. By the way, we are cooking uh, turkey. I believe it is the brand Jenny O. Damn, I can't open this with one hand. Hold on, give me a second, let me put y'all down. Yeah, brand is Jenny O. I think it's like 93.7, so 93% lean, 7% fat. Now we're gonna add this. My mom told me to add this. Kind of gets rid of that nasty turkey taste. So we're gonna add a little bit of that. You can be generous with it. I mean, it's just spices. They don't really add calories. I'm gonna add a good amount of this because this is really good stuff. This right here is kicking chicken finger licking. I don't know. Anyways, my mom uses it for like meats and stuff like that. So now with that, we got that on there. Let's go ahead and move this around, man, because the bottom is really cooking up. Hey! Shut your bitch ass up! This pan's low-key kind of small, so we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to work this turkey. We need to flip this. All right, shut, shut your bitch ass! Jesus Christ, man. Come on, get in. You dumb as hell, boy. All right, y'all, we back again with the Mustang. I haven't been bringing you guys any type of content on the Mustang, but... It's been making a very weird noise lately. That's why I haven't given it a wash. Yeah, as you guys can see, it's super dirty. It doesn't deserve one, obviously, because it's making a really, really weird noise. It kind of sounds like it's clunking. I can give you guys like a little demo of what it kind of sounds like. Kind of sounds like this. But it's not this because I already took it off and I test drove it and the noise is still there. I already checked the front suspension. Everything is tight. Everything is good. Nothing is loose. Now, what I didn't check was the rear suspension, so we're gonna go ahead and remove the wheel. I got three of the lug nuts off, and we're basically just gonna check the suspension and make sure everything is tight, make sure nothing is loose. Obviously, if there is something loose in the back end, then that's gonna be our problem. Hopefully, fingers crossed. But anyways, yeah, let's get straight to it. We're gonna have to jack up the car a little more because the tire's not off the ground yet. Finally had time to put this car in the garage. I don't know if you guys know if you guys are subscribed to my channel, but but my older brother's Camaro is always in the garage. It's garage kept, so. Big old meaty tire. All right, y'all, now that we got the tire off, uh, let's check it out, see if anything's loose. Right off the bat. I don't see anything loose on here see anything loose Ow! yeah it's kind of hard man you got to go one by one try to figure out where the noise is coming from and I already checked the front suspension nothing's loose there we're checking the rear suspension I literally see nothing loose here I don't know what it could be guys honestly I'm gonna be honest with y'all all right guys, so I ended up finding out the problem with my car. It was actually the stabilizer bar link and it was on the passenger side. Um, so that basically connects to the sway bar and then that connects to the strut of the coilover. So it was basically loose from the top and the bottom. I don't know if you guys watched my other video where I got the coilovers adjusted by a shop. And this shop is very known for doing coilovers and stuff like that. So, so in order for them to mess with the camber plate on the top, they had to remove the strut and then they had to install it back in. I guess for some reason they forgot to tighten up the stabilizer bar link. So that's basically what was making the noise because after that I test drove it. No noise, no noise whatsoever. I actually inspected the suspension in the front and I didn't find anything. I was going with my hand and trying to see if anything was loose. But yeah, I think it was just funny to me that a shop that specializes in installing coilovers. I know a lot of people make mistakes. I'm glad that it was just that and it wasn't something else. I really thought it was gonna be like a suspension part. So like a control arm or the sway bar or this and that, the tie rod end. So yeah, as far as parts on this car, I don't think I'm gonna be upgrading anything soon. I'm just keeping up with maintenance. So yeah, that's gonna be it for the video guys. Thank you all so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, smash the like button down below. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button down below. We just hit 4,000 subscribers. Thank you all so much for the love and support. But I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.